Okay, hi gamers. Hopefully you can all hear me and I'm not too loud or too quiet. I'm looking at the audio. It seems all right. Um, <laughs> sorry for the webcam, <laughs> but I thought I couldn't have much of a chat with you guys without you see my face. So, um, yep, yeah, that's what I look like anyway. So this is the, uh, the face behind the voice, as it were. Um, I do have a face, Chris, sort of a <laughs> sort of. <laughs> I'm not actually a dark god. Uh, not yet, anyway. Um, okay, guys, so we're going to spend a couple of minutes just sort of talking through the way that I want. I want this to be quite an interactive session, right? So I was hoping we might be able to get a few uh, ideas in terms of how we do this Let's Play. So I've got a few questions for you. <laughs> God, you savage. <laughs> I'm glad the audio is working. Thanks, guys. Um, right. First question, do we play with any mods on or off? Do we have any of those events in? Do we have them not in? I know the events have been tweaked a bit in the main game. That was in the last um, in the last patch. But personally, I'd probably rather play with the monks. It makes the game a little bit harder. I'll probably regret this. But what do you guys think? Should we have them on or off? No problem with mods. Voice works. Good. Thank you, guys. I've never used mods. Okay, well, I use mods a lot, Finn, um, or the Finn, forgive me. Do with mods. Okay. Next question. Which mods? I'm guessing the uh, an actual English Minimals event pack. Let's get that. Make sure it's loaded up right now. Dee, 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 dee. Apologies if you can hear my kids in the background. My wife's just trying to settle them. <laughs> this is uh, late for them. But sometimes I just don't want to sleep. That's a bit gander. Map size, oh my word. I don't think my computer can handle that map size, Chris. I think it'd be fun with mods. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So let's get some mods installed. I think we've got an actual Englishman and Moors already. Let's just double check. I just got the narrative one. Mid challenges. Now this is going to be quite a lot more difficult because... The game now, you can't avoid uh, events. Previously, if you had a, a challenge that took less than 10 turns, I want to say, um, you wouldn't get an event, right? You can't avoid them anymore. They're just certainly going to happen. So it's a bit more brutal to have the mods uh, installed, especially this one, because I think it introduces a lot of more difficult things. Mods, mods, more events. Cool, cool. Right, we've got an event. Is there any specific? Has any, anybody in the chat made a mod that you'd like me to add into here? Maybe. Let's have a, a little look-see. So far, I've got an actual Englishman and Moors mid-challenge event pack and their preview one as well, I want to say. We're playing as um, Ophanim, obviously, in this playthrough, so not all the mods are going to work, I don't think. Just wait for the chat to catch up. 60 by 60 size sounds challenging, but we can give it a go, wrist off. Um, okay, let's leave the mods on. We're going to, well, I'm going to rather load up the game and hopefully nothing breaks. <laughs> Famous last words, right? <laughs> and you guys can help me set up the game too, because I do want to get some gameplay. I was. Um, Concerned, I could literally spend an hour and a half just talking about the game and setting it up and not literally doing anything. So let's get some gameplay in. Uh, make sure there's some actual entertaining, hopefully, content here. I hope everybody's having a <laughs> don't break it, lol. I'll try not to, Aaron. So for those of you that don't know, um, Aaron Longstaff there, he's a massive, massive YouTuber. Like, massive, right? He's got... 300,000 subscribers, I want to say. Uh, he's huge, and he basically taught me everything I know. So thank you, Aaron, very much. Uh, he told me how to make thumbnails. He told me how to record stuff, ev like everything. Bless him. So uh, give him a lot of love in the chat, if you wouldn't mind. And also, I can't imagine any of you know me and don't know him, but check out his channel. Like I said, it's significantly more professional and better than mine. <laughs> so... Yeah, he's a very, very good lad and an excellent, uh, excellent content creator. So, I think it's time we cut to the game. 
Oh, I've got the chat coming up on here as well. What the flip? Oh, I am more professional than I thought. I forgot about all this. This is <laughs> what happens when you deal with an amateur. <laughs> right, so let's switch to the next scene, I think they're called now. I think we're finished with our quick chat. If anybody has any questions, just throw them in the chat. So we're at the game here. Here we are. You can hopefully see all of this. You've got my face, I'm afraid. Apologies. Um, right. Let's just double check the options real quick. We're not having any music, so I'm putting on my own music today. Uh, this all looks fine to me. We don't want the auto save on. Or do we? No, we'll leave it off. Map view location, that's all fine, fine, fine. We'll the high zoom. Good, 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 good. Dismiss. Right, so let's go into new game here, guys. And girls. Let's go to Ophelim. We'll do the quick, the divine beyond, right? So do with a quick summary here. Um, actually, I'm not going to read this. You can read this at your leisure. If you're watching this after the, the live stream, you can obviously pause the video and just check this out. I won't bore you with me reading this out. It's pretty cool, though. It's basically about some guy who got um, <laughs> killed <laughs> uh, speaking about Ophelim and how glorious he or she or it is. Um, and the mechanics of Ophelim, if you're not sure. Oh, we should mention the contributing designer here is a guy called, or a lady perhaps, called Archie Phoenix. Um, I've seen them in the Discord quite a bit, actually. I think they're quite active. A great, such a good concept for a god. I love this whole duality, right? Which is what Ophanim's all about. Let's just quickly check the chat here before I miss some things. De -de 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 -de. Just heard of him through Unia Blanca. Well, definitely check out Aaron. He's significantly larger than me. Plays Ark primarily, which is um, a great game. He's very skilled. Does things that I can't imagine how you would do. Builds things that are just incredible. Um, anything like for mods, you never bother the hero since they try to attack me. I don't know, Aaron. Okay, I'll check him out, definitely. Oh, my webcam's frozen. Oh, it has. Let's see if I can fix this. It doesn't appear that they work. Let's have a look. Oh, my word, what an awful place to freeze as well. You can still hear me, I'm guessing. Hold up, we'll try something here real quick. Oh, thank you very much, Aaron. <laughs> thank you for... Uh, you didn't have to, mate. You've given me enough, I think. But thank you very much. That's very kind. Oh, my God. And we've got a member as well. Flipping heck, I'm missing everything here. Let's have a look at this. I might just bin off the camera. I mean, you've seen me now, right? Is there much? Are we that bothered? What does the, what does the chat say? Do we want the camera on or off? Seems to be playing up. Thank you for everybody that's becoming becoming a gamer and supporting. Thank you very much for that. Sound working, still hearing. So, shall I bin off the cam? Do we think, ladies and gents? Or I am keen to get it to work, but oh my word, hold up. This is what happens when you're doing with an absolute amateur, guys. Apologies. <laughs> if Cam don't work, we could do without it. I like Cam. Okay, hold on. Let's try and get it back on. Curious, this. Why it's frozen here. <laughs> okay, I think I can fix this. That he says. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I think you know you have a real face. <laughs> we don't need to prove you've uh, anything to prove us with the camera. No problem. Let's just conquer some worlds. Sit to yourself. It's all good. Right. In the in this. For the sake of not just spending forever trying to get my camera to work, we'll. Uh... No, it's gone, guys. It's dead. It's brown breaded. Right, let's shift this thing out of the way as well, then. Do, 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 do. Right, it's gone. There we are. 
disappeared. I passed the you are a human test. I didn't even realize that as a test. All right, I can start picking my nose and things now then so you can't see me, excellent. So we can all relax, fantastic. Until my camera comes on, just randomly, but there we go. Apologies for that, guys. God knows what's happened. It's been literally on the whole rest of the pre-stream. But anyway, I've literally spent hours trying to make sure it got the right angles. You know, the good side <laughs> my face. <laughs> the only side. So anyway, what was I saying? Ophelium is about the duality, right? She, she or he or it is um, a god that plays on sort of good and bad. Um, bad elements, namely faith and uh, shadow. So one half, and we'll select it now. One half is the faith, and this is, it's a really curious thing, this. So faith kind of counteracts shadow, is the first thing, right? So you can have shadow, as with any god, the normal corruption that any god can do. But then faith can also grow from shadow. And if shadow gets particularly high, faith will start to grow in reaction to it and reduce the shadow, okay? And Faith is our Ophanim's particular version of shadow. It's um, slightly stronger in some cases, slightly weaker in others. Militarily, it's stronger, right? So it's stronger in terms of uh, compared to really the Dark Empire, but it has some weaknesses. Um, and the main weakness that you can see on the screen there is doubt. And doubt is, as it, you know, as it says on the tin, right? It's when uh, humans are concerned about this faith and perhaps have a bit of uh, a bit of fear of it and think it's not quite as holy as it might seem. Now, Ophanim, the reason why I haven't done this earlier, really, why I haven't played as Ophanim before, is because um, Ophanim's gone through quite a major change in that the, the the holy orders has introduced a big change for every god, but Ophanim in particular, because it links, Ophanim gets his own unique holy order, which is fantastic. I love it. Um, and it, uh, you can tailor it to suit whatever needs you want. It's got its own unique tenets. It's, it's it's really quite interesting. I've got an idea of what I want to do in this playthrough. We'll see if it's going to work. I don't think it's going to be optimal at all, right? But <laughs> we're going to give it a go anyway. And I'll, depending on the map, we'll see. So we're going with Ophanim. Hopefully that's a good enough of a, an overview. Has anybody got any particular questions? Do, 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 do. An agent completely changed on the camera. I think they did. Somebody's obviously sabotaged me here. Dark Holy Order indeed, Jacob. So what size uh, map do we want to go for here? We've got to go to bigger than 42 by 42. I like square maps for some reason, so maybe 55 by 55? I think somebody threw 60 by 60, the largest map. 60 by 60, Jacob. Right, okay, let's do it. This is going to be a bit of a... <laughs> I may not win this game, <laughs> just so we're all aware. We're going to random the world. We're not going to do seeds 1 to 2 or 0 to 2, forgive me. Difficulty. <laughs> oh, 64, 64 is the max, is it? Apologies. What's your first pick for an agent for this guard? Well, I don't many choices, to be honest. Uh, the Hulusalora. Uh, oh my word, I butchered that. I think we've got the supplicant or the supplicant. Good luck. No, tur no turn limit, Ristoff. Hold up. Let's take a quick vote on that. Right. Normal is fair. Okay, we'll do normal. Thank God for that. Turn limit, guys. What are we saying? Advanced options. On or off? Wrist off. We've got one for no turn. That's going to be... <laughs> we can make this a long series. <laughs> no turn limit, right? Okay. I'm keen. Are we sure? All right, we'll turn it off. I rarely play with the turn limit off, but I don't see any... Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm always turn with it off. Okay, fair enough. I always play with it on, so we can mix it up a little bit. Orcs on or off? Semi deep ones. And the alliance, what are we saying? I think we've got to leave the alliance on as it is. This, no alliance is going to be too easy, right? And even if we can shadow and infiltrate it, I think that's going to be quite easy too. Normal. So we're saying last stand, yeah? I agree. Orcs and deep ones on, right? Yeah, we'll leave them on. Unless anybody... Oh, humanity vulnerable now. Do they help distract with the religion plan? Orcs on. If you... You could do it under 200 turn before we go wrong on a big map, I'll like turn it off. Okay. 
Gotta love the green boys. Regular alliance, don't mind deep ones. Fine, okay, we're leaving it as it is. No turn of me, guys. This is gonna be bonkers. Narrative elements, mid challenge events, obviously, we need them on. End of turn movement events, I'm gonna leave them on. Use black strike out for enshadowment graphics. Oh, curious. Oh, this is if we don't want the. In addition to, maybe, the new. I'm gonna leave that off. Shuffle the map seed for sure. Ugh, I'm not a fan of Pangea, but if you want me to do it, we can do it. Um, Pangea's too easy, smaller island's too hard, in my opinion, but go on, what are we saying? No black line for Shadow, fine. What are we saying about the map generation, ladies and gents? I honestly can't deal with the lines because FD4 just tends to own me. No Pangea, I like regular. Let's see if it's regular. So most people can look at this and see a normal inverted commas game, but that doesn't ever end. Holy orders, they need to be on. I wonder what happens if you try and play opening with that one. In fact, I've done it. I think it just... Um, He's the only one with the Holy Order. It's a bit broken, but fair. Um, I don't want Orders dominate, I don't think. As you can see there, if you select this, every human location will have a Holy Order of some description that it follows. It becomes a bit silly, like they're everywhere, right? Uh, limited options, Holy Orders only have a random subset of possible tenants. I like this because it keeps the Holy Orders unique. Hello, Simpson. Thank you for all your videos. They convinced me to give this game a try. Thank you, Super Paper. I'm glad you tried the game. I hope you enjoy it. And, uh, well, welcome. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you all for watching, obviously. Um, I hope you enjoy this. What's... <laughs> kind of, it's already been a mess. <laughs> We've already lost the webcam, but there we go. <laughs> number of witches. So how many witches should we have? I reckon three is a good number, but I'm just partial to three as a number generally. Four witches. Okay. Jacob is... Really leading the, the charge here as far as designing this game is concerned. And once we get into the game, I'm going to tell you my plan. I think, depending on how the game looks, it might be quite a bad plan. I don't know. I think if you leave it blank, it spawns none, I would suspect. I think that would take that as zero. Blank where if you leave the number of witches blank. That would be my guess. I don't want to risk it, because I do kind of want witches in the game. Uh, maybe. <laughs> right, let's move on. Human responses. We'll leave all this on, right? Magical arms, right? Does it ever escorts? Conclaves. Yes, 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 yes. Wrist off 22. Do I think the deep ones will get a rework at some point? I really hope so, to be honest. Um, they are... They're fun. And they're slowly getting little bits added. They've got... Um, you know, they've had uh, this sanctum where people, uh, agents, rather, can lay low like properly lay low they can't be attacked or anything which is quite an interesting mechanic it's unique to them but you know when you're talking lovecraft for me deep ones are such a a classically lovecraftian thing that they're almost the two go hand in hand you've got to you can't have one without the other almost so i think they should be expanded quite significantly but then again i would like i know orcs have had a massive expansion but i'd like them to be a little bit more interesting personally and possibly more useful they're not the best as it is um, dee -dee 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 -dee. thank goodness no cats you didn't miss anything <laughs> really apart from the generation of the map but we haven't even done that yet so you're, you're in at a good time welcome deep ones holy orders would be cool they kind of got a mini sort of one i've got a tenant unique to them which is kind of good wish i had a minion or two i guess we're talking about either orcs or deep ones i agree oh, orcs have got them same as we talk about deep ones yes i agree Maguire, welcome yes leave magic you may need it wasn't part of my plan, but I can I can always use magic. Can 100 turns to establish deep sea relaxation center for your agents? <laughs> yes, I think so. <laughs> Hello, Sora, definitely. Right. Let's start. And we'll get the cheeky bong. Let's see if I can get my webcam back on. I don't think it's working, but... No, it's super dead. He's brown bread. Apologies, guys. The light's on, but nobody's home. Okay, go away, hints. Nobody wants to look at you. Right, let's take a look at the map. Deep on agents, they, need to, they do need to do deep on agents. Let's have a look at the map. So we've got, oh, okay, well, <clears throat> I know what I'm doing on this island. Let's have a quick gander. It's going to go a bit laggy because we're on a fairly big map. And we take a look at the nations, right? Ooh, okay, so we've got... Where we started, Little Island, that's a pain. 
in some respects, but not the worst for Oveney. Oveney actually benefits a little bit from being on an island location. We've got a huge, look at the size of this. What's this, the kingdom of what? Wei Sang, that is giganormous if I'm not mistaken. It's all, look at this. I suspect that will split. I wouldn't be surprised. This red one ain't small either, what's that? Kingdom of Nu Nu Yanto. Oh, from the Pinak, honestly, the pronunciations of some of these is unbelievable. The horde is mm, weak-ish. Is that another? No, it's three. They've got three. They've got something there. Small, small island. Are these linked by land? They are. Okay, so this is all one continent, right? All of this. All of this, 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 this is one. Oh my gosh, all of this is. <gasps> what the flip? This is an island, we're on an island, and everything else is one. Damn, right, okay. Why isn't this taken? Why have they not colonized the area down to the south here? No monies, presumably. Okay. Okay. What's, what's the... Uh... <laughs> what are the, what are the, what's the chat saying? <laughs> do, 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 do. If it needs this YouTube streaming thing, been to Twitch previously, can I somehow put the chat on the same level as the video? Or do I have to keep going up and down? Oof, yellow is huge. Tell me about it, Blangra. Hello, hello, source. I'm going to get your name right eventually. Um, I have no idea. I'm also new. This is my first ever uh, stream. Apologies. So you're talking to an absolute scrub here yourself. Maybe someone in the chat can help. Maguire with a deep one tenant and a high shadow island. I was making a deep one to send every 15 turns in no madness. Damn. Surprise there's no mod from a Western naming convention yet. Your PC okay. It's, <laughs> well, the, the webcam's gone. Uh, and it's, it's okay. It's not making too much noise. I hope, I don't think you can hear it. Maybe you can, who knows. Um, but no, I think it's okay. When you zoom out this, it, it lags it all the time, I think, when you zoom out so far. Especially on such a big map. So... Let us have a little peeky here. Right, the plan is, I think, and I'm quite happy to take some uh, advice on this. The plan is, we're going to in shadow our island, right? We're on the island, our tomb spread shadow anyway. We're just going to in shadow this straight up classic in shadow. I would have liked to have turned this into a dark empire, but it is kind of shweak. We might end up having to, but bleh, that's what one thing we're going to do. Let's check out the Holy Orders. Brotherhood of Ruing. We can rename these. Ruing. And if anybody's got any good names for these, throw them out. Church of Heshang. What I want to do... Mmm, that looks kind of tasty. Convoca Convocation of Hoatian. Oh, damn. That's not small either, but... Whoops. Convocation of Hoatian. <laughs> but it's kind of weirdly spread. Just going over that sea area there, just here. It's peculiar. And then we've got our circles. And then we've got our own faith. Right, we're going to rename this. Let's have a gander. There's some help in for the... I think the Western, by the way, I'm sorry, Finn, I skipped your question, uh, or statement rather, but in terms of a mod for Western naming convention, that for sure is going to come. I think from what I've gathered, I've, so I've got some events in here that are um, unreleased as yet, it's a bit of a spoiler, guys, but I've managed to sweet talk myself into the guys that are making some of the um, events or working with Bobby to make the events in the game, and they've given me a bit of a preview in terms of some of what's coming, so I've got some spoiler events in here. In the base game, I mean. Um, and I'm fairly sure one of them suggested that there might be a way to change the names to make them more Latin, more Anglo-Saxon, more classic fantasy, you know, whatever. But I think that's definitely coming. What trait am I going to use for the supplicant? Well, that's a question. I, I've got, I personally like Duality and uh, Inquisitor, but I, probably one of those. Dark Island, for sure. 3 a.m. stream, crikey, Infinite Wither. Thank you for joining us. Welcome. Bless you. I'll try and get some sleep. 
Um, after the stream, of course. Not a joke, <laughs> when you feel tired. Uh, I'll pop the chat off and it's only a little top of the screen, so that works. Okay, cool, cool, cool. The Nietzsche Geomancy spell would let them expand if they're Geomantic Loci on the island. Not sure what you're referring to, Maguire. The religions are a bit of a headache, so glad to see someone who knows how they work to go through them. Right, okay, cool. My plan is as follows. We're going to spread the faith, obviously, in the biggest... Hold up, one sec. Ideal, right? The largest nation... Get away. The largest nation has little... This one here, look. What is it called? We need to know the names. Wei Sang has little in the way of... Um, Religions, I believe. See, so only a couple spread in here, and that is who? Da, 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 Brotherhood of Ruing. So my plan is to make this. <sighs> this might be a bad idea, actually. You might want to go for some smaller ones to start with, some smaller locations. Nations, rather. <laughs> but my plan is quite simple. We got, Especially given we've got infinite turns, right? We're going to spread our faith quite far. We're going to make this a Shadow Island. Starters. Straight up. Where's the other Witch Covens? Dee -dee 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 -dee. Where are they? Ah. Go away. Wrong. Let's have a Gandar. You are wrong. Certainly not right. Where is it? My word. This map. This map though. Oh, it's taking me forever. Share if you can see it in chat, guys. <laughs> if I'm just being absolutely blind here. <laughs> Where is this? I can see that one. Looks like V-Circles at the top. This one here, is it? Yeah, that's V. So where's wrong? I wish I could click on these and it would take me to the location. That'd be useful. Rather than the... Um, the Holy Order screen, as it were. So I'd like to see where these are. Start getting the shadow going. So Vis is no good to us. It's on our island, which is going to be in shadowed anyway. Kung Circle, where are you? Da, 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 da. Yeah, they are hard to see. I agree, Maguire. They are super difficult to see. Like, where is this thing? There it is. That's useful. That's useful right next to here. It's a shame that these religions are um, on our doorstep, but that is useful. That's Kung, isn't it? So Kung's useful. Vice is fairly useless. Where's Su Chang? Su Chang's down here. Also fairly useful, but I am tempted. My broad plan is this. Tell me if you agree or not, and if you'd like me to do something different. But my broad plan is quite simple. Spread the oath, uh, our faith. We're going to rename it. Give me some names, please, in a second. Um, so we're going to rename our faith, but I'm going to spread it in some small locations, okay? Small nations. We're going to shadow the island that we're on. I don't need to show it yet, but we're going to shadow the island that we're on. And we're going to take over the most successful religion, and we're going to make a baroness, and we're going to make them vampires. <laughs> That's my vague plan, right? Because hopefully it's all about light and dark, and to me, it doesn't get much more dark than a vampire holy order, right? That is it. We're going to have a dark empire, maybe, we'll see, on our island, but we're going to have the sort of the dark on our island. Um, and then we're going to have, like I said, the open in faith, of course, righteous and holy as it is, acting. Um, in the maybe the midsection of the board here, this is going to be a tough game. Thank God I've got the tournament off, because this is going to be fairly difficult, I reckon. There's a bit, quite a bit of devastation and unrest here there's some obviously some fireworks kicking off but just the, sh the sheer size of this is potentially going to be difficult simply not evil yeah we can we're gonna have to be evil i think so is blangra let's have a quick gander i think i missed a fair bit of the chat church of starry wisdom super paper i like it the pure flame i like that too jacob let's have a gander the key with the religions generally is religions that are humanity aligned, right? So when I'll just quickly show you. So those that aren't a circle or as, yeah, these here, Convocation, Church and Brotherhood, you want to make them generally just, um, generally you just want to make them inert, right, useless, i.e. give them tenets that are kind of poor 
uh, but don't particularly bother about corrupting them just make them ineffective yeah the circles the witches you want to potentially choose one in my opinion and use that one spread it and then use it as best you can normally in conjunction with the dark empire to do the what's it called arbomancy effect to keep the um keep the dark empire as powerful as you can right using that magic using that uh, sort of geomantic almost magic making the habit habitability better making the prosperity better etc making your army stronger right um ophanim's faith well we'll get there when we get there but you want to use it just to make your force in my opinion as strong as possible i normally use it to quell doubt that's my favorite way to use it but there's quite a few different ways you can let's catch up on the chat again i like the pure flame that's a great jacob that's a great show leader of the faith kind of surprised by your choice well villain they had different horses for courses watching on pc the chat oh thank you aaron for sorting this bless you Church of Starry Wisdom, I do like that as well. But that sounds more to me like potentially a Witch's Coven idea, which we can certainly rename. Raising Habitability lets them settle and have more population. Third man is chat. Duality trait builds up Menace quickly on Supplicants, good for turning a small minion nation to a Theocracy. Duality builds up Menace now. I suppose if you're using it all the time, but you can lay low, obviously, right? Nurture raises Habitability, yep, yep. You're probably in theatre mode. Inquisitor. The large areas of faith. Inquisitor. I do like Inquisitor. I've got to be honest. Chris and uh, Hula Saucer again. Am I wrong? Is that double the amount of religions unusual? I have got quite a few. I put more circles in. Oh my word. I've missed so much chat. Oh my god. I'm so far behind. Oh flip. <laughs> Middle left or wrong. Thank you. Super paper. Same. <laughs> Right, let's have a gander. The witches on your island can spread deep on culture on your island. That's not a bad chat, actually. But I, I think him doesn't like deep ones in my head, <laughs> so that might not be suitable. <laughs> are you gonna play far away from shadow and near? We are gonna use the faith, absolutely. Yeah, so absolutely, uh, Hullasaur. So we've got to spread the faith that I'm going to work on needs to be away from the Ophidim faith or they're going to, like you just said there, the Ophidim faith will either take over that one or vice versa, potentially. So let's rename the Ophidim faith. What are we calling it again? What did I like? The Pure Flame. It's oh, that, that is a very Ophidim title. Whoops, whoops, whoops. The pure flame. I love it. Close that. And I think, what's the circle we want to go for? Oh, where's wrong again? Mid. Mid right, did we say? Honestly. Stealth mode. Well, listen, if we can't find it now. It ain't worth finding. Oh, there it is. Wrong. Do, 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 do. Uh, okay, so it's kind of in the area where I wanted to play with that holy order. Right, let's get to the supplicant. So let's take a look at these. We've got, just for those that don't know, if you're new to this, you've got duality. So as you can see there, it's this is the sort of classic opening for me. When you complete an infiltrate challenge, you add either 30 shadow, or you start an Ophanim cult, automatically 20% charge. Those are your two options. Or you add to an existing one. Okay? And it flips. So you infiltrate, you spread shadow, you infiltrate again, you do the faith, you spread shadow again, you do the faith. And it just keeps flip, 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 flip. Really good. That's kind of good for getting your um getting the faith going quite quickly, but it can be risky. Leader of the faith, increase any existing Ophanim faith by 2% per turn while in the same location. Again, very useful getting the faith up, but I've found that this can increase doubt quite a lot. And you haven't got the tools of Inquisitor, right? So I think I'm going to go for Inquisitor. It's just... Uh, it's just so useful, I think, especially when I'm doing this long game. Let's go for Inquisitor. Picking that for now. And we're obviously going to start infiltrating, right? Who was the... Very quickly, somebody's become a member, I believe. 
they are going to be the first agent name of, unless you don't want to be, please let me know. Let's have a quick... Da, 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 da. I'm sure we did have a member popped up earlier. How do I check this without ruining everything? Dee -dee 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 -dee. I use leader, otherwise I always lose. I'm a word villain. Well, let's see if we can hopefully help. Fedden can. Thank you very much. You're the person that joined. Would you like to be our supplicant, Fedden? I will give you a second to respond in case you'd rather not. Oh, is a Braxus one havoc? Oh my god, look at this text. Awful as well. Um, you won't be happy with that. I need to fix that big time. Damn, in fact, can I do it now? <laughs> Let's see if I can quickly fix this. So it doesn't look quite as oh my word. I'm making it worse somehow. Sorry, mate. It's just gonna have to look a bit rubbish. I may pay with she who will feast or stuff. The start I got nothing wrong with she who will feast. Right. Let us. Nah, I think that's the latest subscriber. There and that one. I'll give uh, our member a chance to, to say if they would like to be our supplicant. So supplicant's going to do this. Now, if you don't know, Ophanim has one of the most crazy powers in the game, Sleeper Slaver, where you can force an agent just to do some hard work, which we're going to do now, speed things up a bit. Be careful. If you get any negative events, you can lose them pretty quick. So it's going to take him a little bit of time. Our poor supplicant, bless him, because we've only got the one. Skip through some turns here. Praying for some not nasty events. War already, right? Church of Hishang declares war on the kingdom of Nigdu. Reasons for the war, base reluctance, okay, always. International relationship is bad, preference danger. A church? Hold up. Oh my word. What is up with this church? What's going on here? Let's check this. <laughs> what have they got? What are your moral tenets? Okay, so you're fairly your healers. Nothing particularly evil here, but I suspect what's happened is you've got a ruler, sister, Denyin Wanapu, loves danger. And they've got a bad relationship, I'm guessing, because of the... Well, they're going to get absolutely battered, I think, by the looks of things. The strength of their army. 80. Oh, maybe not, you know. 32, 26, and 10. It could be a decent fight, this. Curious, rename the face to smiley face, God. I mean, listen, we can do, but it's a bit, uh, <laughs> it's not very uh, law appropriate. Not maybe for this. Maybe that's more of an Easter faith, I think. Then you're just based off a movie or some characters. Never played with Holy Orders, or you're in for a treat. Ah, uh, okay. I don't think it's a... Uh, Intransigent Faith, Blangra, as you can see. I don't think that's... From what I can tell, that uh, Holy Order hasn't got that. They're just, they've just they got a seriously danger-loving um, ruler. Let's take a look at our little island. What's going on up here? Oh, I'll bottle job this. I should have done it earlier, but we're going to use it again. No, I'm not. I've got no power. Silly. We're going to wait, and we're going to use it soon. Da -da 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 -da. This music's very appropriate for this game. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Purely random. So we've infiltrated the holy site. Lovely. Oh, that's the Baroness in a in a cup, if you like. So that's nice and easy. Baroness in a cup. What the hell? SFG, sort that out. Um, <laughs> Ready-made Baroness is the words I'm looking for. So we're going to leave this to get some shadow. I may want to come back and steal it, but yeah, it's only got four gold, so we're not going to steal from it just yet. It's too busy doing things and I'm very likely gonna infiltrate this coven too. Ten turns is more appropriate. A night out at an inn. Okay, so it's a new event. Four night games. This is a new event by uh Bobby. And I don't know if there's two guys or more maybe helping with this, but uh this week the supplicant finds he has no more tasks to be completed. Everything is in order for now. No poisons or bribes to administer to officers, no traitors, no accidents or opportunity. Okay, cool. Instead of DC's villages in a workings of grant of a hope for the coming week, a rare chance to simply let loose and enjoy himself. Decent. Whatever else would he end up wherever else would he end up but in an inn. 
Reduce menace by five. Mm. Okay, well it's an easy choice. We've only got menace. Sweet. Dismiss. Oh, we've got a, a circle's got a profit. That is, hold up. Hold up, by circle. I don't like that because I thought that was one that I wanted to play with. Get out of here. Mm -hmm. Let's have a gand. Oh, is that the one near me? Oh, okay. No danger. <laughs> That's gonna. <laughs> that'll be shortly in shadow. I wouldn't worry. Baron and Chinku has died of old age. Gutted. King Kun Chai is aware. Now, hold up. Ah, is this the chosen one, the mediator Rang Min Jiang? Nah. It's Xian Feng. I'm tempted to watch her because I do really need to watch on um, Will Panic. And uh, awareness, obviously, with Open it is just critical. You've got to stomp that awareness out. Mm hmm. Okay. We'll keep an eye on these. Just kind of suck when you're playing as a uh, when you're playing as open to start with only having one agent, but it is the play style. Let's infiltrate the coven. I know they've got a profit, but I think we'll be able to do some work. Fed and Can was the new member. Thank you, Aaron. I won my first 0.10 game with less than 20 turns left after my Dark Empire was destroyed after the biggest kingdom started a war with it with you from insanity. Nice. I'm guessing you're playing as. I'm gonna guess that was the Asta wrist off. Uh, in it, a sim for everything's number one to be on a bar crawl. Obviously not. Come on. Everybody's gotta let loose. This angelic figure. <laughs> Opinion swayed. Brother Mulan Huailin has preached, of course, the Holy Order complication of Huaishan's managed to sway bonus. Jiao Juke Hyang Heng Jing. Jeez, I mean, honestly, some of these. I could do with it being a bit less Asian. Um. Or Oriental, I suppose. These languages, it's very difficult to pronounce for me. Let's increase our opinion. And I've got a Chinese wife, right? My wife is of Chinese descent, so <laughs> I think I should be better. <laughs> the complication of Hoatian is making them lose any preference for other faiths. Lose any previous preference for other faiths. Okay, interesting. Oh, look at this awareness. It is going... Absolutely yeah, wall here. So this is the problem, guys. When, if you're not aware, awareness spreads by characters interacting with locations, and I think it's laying low and rest, uh, rest and resupplying rather, at locations that have got awareness. Uh, heroes that are aware will then go and spread it to other locations, and it becomes this like a domino effect. Right, it becomes a real, real big problem. Um, something uh, particularly dangerous for opening him. Why don't I? I've got no power. Okay, new event, by the looks. Oh no, old event, sorry, actual Englishman and more. Subcuts are in a group of native fauna. I've seen this artwork, I'm sure this is in the new events. I'm, so, I'm almost certain. The fauna's aggressive, it's even closed up to kill. We can either kill them, lose. Oh, I think that's a good deal. Keeping the menace low for free is decent. King Ping Peng, oh my word, another king. Is this how you're gonna do me, game? She ain't guarding, is she, by any chance? I've got to watch this. God damn, Chosen Mongers. They can be a pain. We catch you so great, keeps you as busy for cheap. Yes, I do like my line catch. It's one of my favourite all time challenges, but it's going to take us a little bit of time to get there with poor Rofen him. How long we got? I don't want to wait. I'm just going to use a sleepless lay with this. Fanny Ann Beach, right, where's that? On an island, curious. Religious tension, okay. Sister Liang, Mi, Jingjian has spread the influence of the Holy Order Church of Heshang to the city of Namei, displacing the Brotherhood of Ruing, increasing the tension between the two orders. This may cause violence between their acolytes. Uh, so they're not, they haven't got any strange but that's interesting. Brotherhood of Ruing, and who does she? If we try the coven, dismiss. Who 
who's her who's her religion why doesn't it tell me that's surely it should tell you Church of Heishang, what was she? City of Nibdu. It's the same one. Mm hmm. Am I might have been stupid here? Possibly. Quite possibly. We've leveled up our supplicant. Nice. Now. No, 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 no. I think law is the way. And we will find out if that's a good choice fairly shortly. We don't need to lay low. We're fine for now. <laughs> it's a capital which kind of sucks. We've got no money. Has this got money? Three. God, he's honestly so poor. You got money. 92, but I need to still. Let's go down now. I'm going to influence this city, then we're going to try and influence this, and then I'm hoping the shadow will spread passively. Oh, I hate doing this to their bribes. Look at the time, 25. Oh, has any of these got money? 88, yes. 80, yes. Let's take some money. I'm coming for you here, village. I want your money. Dismiss. Should roll a place for 35 gold so you can get a raven? I should. That would be absolutely useful, but I also need to bribe places. <laughs> and thank God we've got an agent slot. We catch what you call with plant docks makes insanity. Oh, okay, interesting. Wasn't the Aster? Curious. We catch so great. Keeps these O's busy for cheap. It is. Chosen ones mediators are so annoying. Oh my God, they are absolutely brutal. I might have to. We might have to have a chat with uh, that chosen one, I think. A physical chat. It could be used to break up large kingdoms of civil war and other things and also make them less likely to join the alliance in the late game. Malign catch. Oh, it's, yeah. Listen, I've got no... I'm with you. Malign catch, I'm all in. I'm so in on uh, malign catch. Right, the question is... Where are we? 35. It's endless anyway, so we don't need to massively panic about the uh, turn 500, but I would like to be done before then. But the question is, do we start some other shenanigans elsewhere oh look at this purple look at this i kind of want this which one is it it's convocation i kind of want this i really want this to be a vampire <laughs> holy order i think <laughs> although this one's got a very appropriate single hashang Where am I less likely to start my faith is the question. This is starting to sneak over to here, so probably more sensible to do the Heshang. What was our... What was our other name? Was it Starry Church of the Starry Light or something? Give me some good names for the... Uh... Church of Starry Wisdom. Oh, hold up. It's got to be related to blood, right? If we're doing a vampire, do we not think? Hey, Surely? Right? Hmm. Does it, does it have to be? Church of Starry Wisdom. I do really like that name. The Crimson Knight. Oh, I do love that. The Healing Blood Church. Kind of on the nose, Jacob. <laughs> Helsing, indeed. Bitey Bitey Baptists! <laughs> oh my word, excellent. Alucard, classic Dracula backwards, indeed. Helsing is an excellent anime for those of you that haven't seen it, both versions. Um, kind of adult mind, very adult actually, particularly the, the second one. <laughs> I kind of like the Crimson Knight, I think. I do love the Church of Starry Wisdom, though. I have to use that for something. Right, let's get this one out. The Crimson Knight. 
Thank you, Blangra. What the hell? Why not? Oh my word. Have I just typed that in the chat? Possibly. What a muppet. You're dealing with an absolute amateur here. Peeps. Right. Oh my word. It's lucky you're not seeing me on the webcam, to be honest, because I'm... The way my mic is, it's right in the way of my uh, <laughs> my keyboard, so I have to type <laughs> like an utter idiot. Right, the Crimson Knight, this is our one. This is our boy. Or girl. Or them, if they prefer. Right, so we're going to make an agent over here. First thing we need to do is a hell of a lot of infiltration. And the main lady for that job has to be, has to be. The trickster, one of my favorite agents. What I'm doing now is I'm trying to see if there's any covens right next to the uh, cathedrals, because that would be ideal. Attack Monkey is weak, I think, personally. Pitmocket Primate is, uh, Pitpocket, sorry, Primate is okay. Um, this is my favourite by far. <laughs> Make friends. Media and manager So we've got two friends there. Lovely job. Infiltrate the host site with the trickster. Won't take her too long. How's the supplicant getting on? He's travelling. He kind of needs to hurry up. What's going on here? What the hell is this? <gasps> what is happening here? Did I send him to attack? Well, this is going to be incredibly bad for us. <laughs> Hold up. We can win this. He's retreated. Oh, man. I'm not sure I wanted this. That shouldn't have happened. I did not ask the supplicant to do that, I am quite sure. Are they even on the same? What the flip? There is no comparative adorable monkey, he's the best. Why did that just happen? I want to know. Oh, another prophet, I need to see who that was. Ruing, it's a brotherhood, presumably incorrectly, the major stereo. Oteons is their prophet. Okay. Well, I'm glad it wasn't our Brotherhood of uh, Blood, whatever it's called. What are they called? The Crimson Knight. Apologies. Let's make this speed up a touch. Mm. Five is your awareness. Oh my word, look at this. Don't like this. Do not like this. So we've got three places fully aware. Um, four, eight, and ten places that are generally aware. So the other ones have got half awareness, but that is, it's dangerous for us, this. Hopefully him does not like faith, uh, awareness, forgive me, at all. He loves faith. <laughs> oh, and Shadow's getting driven back. Sweet, where's this? On our doorstep? Awesome, right, okay, hold up. Oh, honestly. And he's completely killed it. But not on the ruler, which is good because the ruler will make this in Shadowed. I should have been shadowed this place. Foolish, foolish, foolish. But we do also need money. Okay. Let's get some more infiltration going with our uh, Littrickster. You need to hurry up, mate. Come on, today. Cracked Milo. This is one of the yeah, natural linksmen. Just so we can catch the one who's been smiling for several weeks now. The man hobbles and crashes down before his feet. His foamy mouth twisting into a smile as his skin starts turning pale. This one will give no answers. Aye. How dare ye? This is a good one if you've got infiltration. Guess what we ain't got? <laughs> so, this joker. The trickster is making her way to the monastery. He's adequately stopped library. 
through the busy streets and fails to notice when no one else uses the space just under the windows. Which one is it? The tree and bucket. Oh, my word. Yeah, for some reason it's the drunk that gets the beef here when it was somebody else throwing, you know, waste onto the trickster. I don't care about the law, I care about the intrigue. That's five challenge progress. No, no, no. Another king. Hoping to get to the newest bathhouse so it can be re resentable among the monks trying to calm down. Dee -dee 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 -dee. One law point, one intrigue. Yeah, I don't like this awareness spread. I'm getting a bit freaked out at that. An outpost has been funded. Go away. What's the uh, chat saying? I vote bitey bitey bitey. I bet you do, villain. <laughs> Me too, Ristav. Okay, I lost for bitey McVamp. Blood moon worship for the Crimson Knight. Message retracted for some reason. I uh, usually... Use a courtier for infiltration. Reduce security in cities. Trade is handy. I've never used the trickster. The trickster is awesome for infiltration. Plus, she pairs very well with the courtier. If you use the two of them together, they can start some absolute mega vendettas with people. Uh, normally, you need to lose one of them. Is the easiest way to do. It. But she's quite a, she's quite handy in combat. The trickster, I like her. Uh, da, 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 da. You should have that guy as your face cam. Which one's this? <laughs> Who would make a good emote? I don't get it. Try to get Raven on Supplicant. Yeah, good shout. Am I lagging out? Who knows? Let's have a look. I should probably check this thing once in a while and see if it's still working. Oh, it appears to be working. Excellent connection, all that business. Let me know if you can't hear this. I don't know how you're going to let me know. <laughs> <laughs> but hopefully you can. <laughs> right, we've got another. Come on, mate. Oh, another mediator as well. See, the mediators, they just. There's nothing they love more than spreading awareness. You go, walks. Get them. Ah, pure flame can be influenced. Sweet. Oh, come on, man. You should be able to click on that to influence it. Right, it's obviously aligned to us. Oh, it's got temple builders and preachers. Curious, moral. <laughs> it's got to be Crusader Faith, I think. You're not going to have the pure flame in any location that isn't a theocracy, and a theocracy is primarily a military asset. So I think that's the way. We need to look at our menace because of that stupid attack that I didn't want to do. I am devoured. Vice circle. Again, I wish when you clicked that it would just automatically... So, the trick with your witches is to influence their, um, basically get them doing what you want them to do first, and then um, allow them to spread, if that makes sense. If you kind of do it the other way around, they become more unwieldy to manage. So if you want to influence them, you know, if I want to give them three or four different um, uh, tenets, is the word I'm looking for here, it would take me longer if I immediately make them start spreading. If I choose, look, if I choose one of these, that's going to be more locations that I have to then infiltrate to keep them fully influenced, right? Getting this plus eight bonus. The way that it is now, I can just start messing with them in terms of their, I want them to, f I've got to get awareness of gone, haven't I? That's the key, but they're miles away. They are absolute tonks away. I'm not too worried about awareness here because it's a shadow. So I think 
We'll take charitable works. And we might take Arbomancy as well at some point. See if that works for us. Let's have a gun, what are we uh, all saying? Or not, as the case may be. Stream is fine, mate. Thank you, Aaron. You seem fine, Jacob. Thank you. Your map seems focused on war for now. Morning, Andrea. Thank you for joining us. Hull of Saucer. Doesn't that make the nations you control do things that you didn't ask them to? Mainly Crusade. No, so... I believe you're thinking of intrans intransigent faith, look. Which is a moral tenet here. Oh. Dang, that's the wrong one. Why? Why can't I just click on that? Come on. The pure flame, here we go. Do -do 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 -do. Look, it gives a military fervor. Now, military fervor, I think, is a buff on your armies. It doesn't. Uh, it it does imply that it's like um. It's gonna make them more uh, uh, violent, but I don't believe it does. I believe it increases the the strength of their armies. I think what you're thinking of is this intransigent faith, where they hate other faiths. Basically, they will they are they'll declare war on members of other faiths under if, if under the older influence. Okay. That's the one that you potentially want to avoid. Not always, but potentially. The Daughterhood, where is she? We need her. Oh my word, we need her. <gasps> She's here. Right, remember this, peeps. <laughs> Someone remind me of this in 300 turns when we're dying and we need her. <laughs> but she would be a useful asset to... That changes things, right? So... This Holy Order, I don't think, was the one we were interested in. No. So here's the th here's the thinking, right? Oh, it's unfortunate there's a little gap there, but we can literally just turn this all to to wasteland. Oh my god, we can actually the, the first daughter could actually wreck most of this map. Let's save her for a bit. I I think she's gonna be used because this is a big map and I may well need her, but we'll save her for now. Yeah, Caleb, I completely agree. And welcome, by the way. I completely agree. I wish the uh, Holy Audio UI was a lot easier to get to. It is a bit of a pain as it is right now. I'll take all your money. Thank you. Baroness Papron's Lations. You want a name, honestly. And lovely. We've got an Exorcist Nemesis. Do we care? Mm, maybe, because we kind of seem to be randomly attacking peeps. Which ain't had... Oh, and look. We've gone too hard, too fast. 41. What's the shadow? 25, he's 23, he's getting there slowly but surely. Oh, there's been new art on these, right? On the... Hard to tell, but I'm sure there's some cracks there. And I think his eyes go whiter and his hair goes whiter. Now I can lay like a cover, which <laughs> kind of stinks. What's the Lalo bonus here? That's tat anyway, right, okay. Forget that then. Get to the cupboard, my friend. Finally, she can level up. Intrigue, I always take with the uh, trickster first. Oh, by the way, if anybody wants to have a an agent name, um, I think I'll probably save the supplicant for uh, my only <laughs> member. But if anybody else wants to take the trickster, shout out and I'll pop you in. Let's have a look what's been said. Yes, the Holy Audio UI is peak S Shadows Behind the Throne design. It is indeed. <laughs> Jacob Noel wants the tricksters. Well, you jumped in first. And that will get you them. I wish you a long and happy life as our agent, Jacob. Right, don't blame me if you die. 
sure you can call my agent Rex. I'll come wrist off you. Oh my word, honestly, you guys are it's apologies. We'll save the supplicant for now. For our member, in case he does want it. Um, or she. Right, Quiaxi Citadel. What am I doing here? I've infiltrated. I'm just infiltrating on because I need this. I need, I want this holy order. Right, let's do it. I could also. Let's see, Shadow, let's get the coven as well. I am fairly devastated about. I'll recruit a crow. It's a great idea. I'm fairly devastated about that attack. That was like a lot of menace and such that we just didn't need. Infiltrate the coven for me. Trickster, or Jacob, I should say. Sweet. Oh, another war. We need to check this, actually. I should probably... This is a war. Do not... Right, that's where the daughter is. I don't want this place to be destroyed. I do not want this place to be destroyed. Should you start the fade and then even betray it with the trickster since the chosen one is there? Right, if we start the faith, we potentially get doubt and it potentially raises Well panic. It's not a bad idea, but I'm just very Remember we don't want our faith here, right? The faith we want here is the one that is here, this, the Crimson Knight, yeah. We want to make that the vampire faith. The faith, the Ophidian faith, is going to come more around here. But if you're talking about wasting time, that might not be a bad shout. It might not be a bad shout. Oh, you dirt, honestly. Let's hang off it for now. No, you're not laying low, mate. Come on. I'm so, honestly. Poor supplicant. Void lies. This is definitely a mod one. Jacob Noel, <laughs> gutted, encounters vile tubed creatures, not natives of this world. We've seen this before, I think. They are horrendous. There's the heroes. They're almost difficult to see on this picture. Uh, okay, so we can lose two health, or we can lose to 10 challenge progress. <laughs> Let's take the uh, 10 challenge, because I might want to speed her up. Oh, another King's Aware. You're a pain. I should have killed you. 36, you slowly tick up. Too slowly though, too, too slowly. What's the... The Shadow in here is starting to tick up again very slowly. It, we can see, guys, the Shadow is just so slow. He wants to interrupt me, but guess what? You can't interrupt Lolo. <laughs> Unlucky exorcist renihilations. Oh my word, more awareness. A witch is aware. Is this how we're playing? And what's her? It's just fine. But my concern with this actually, do witches, even though they're not actively doing anything with awareness, do they spread it just by virtue of being in a tile with another hero? So if this hero rests, will he gain awareness because he's in a tile with this? I think she has awareness anyway. Yeah. But will he gain it from her too? Does that make sense? That is something that worries me. Because this is where it can just really snowball crazily out of control. Sislami Jan Chianyan has preached the cause of the Holy Order of the Crimson Knight and has managed to sway King, right? Nice. So we've got the Crimson Knight spread in. Kind of what we want, but we have got to be a bit more careful. We don't need to go too far because it'll become a pain to deal with. Sleeper's Labour, thank you. All but finished. Go to. Hold up, can we not? Wait a second. We can't in shadow. Covens. <gasps> Am I an absolute scrub? I thought we could in shadow them. Maybe that's only if it's taken. If they're inactive. Oh my word. Well, at least we can lay low, guys. Trash. Absolute trash. To be fair, it did need to happen because we need the security reducing on this. Right? Minus one because of the uh, coven being infiltrated. Infiltrated. 
Oh, we need the catacombs infiltrated, I think. And we need money as well, which is a bit of a pain. What's the money situation? 42, kind of rubbish. And you'll have non current unrest, okay. This can be a pain when the um, when humanity just starts tearing itself apart without any of your influence. It can actually be troublesome for you. Look, the world panic goes up, and I haven't done much to make it happen. Except attack a hero, I guess. But I didn't do that. The game did. <laughs> Jacob, you're going to do a bit of thievery. You're going to do a bit of infiltrating and then thievery, I think. You must. We got another aware witch. Nice, Jacob. <laughs> so Jacob's menace is reduced by 20 thanks to, who is this? His, her dad, Duke Bainash Jan. And this is the power of the trickster, the courtier, those agents where they've got family. They get these specific events. Oh, I love them. Um, as you can see, he refuses to believe that his child could do such a thing. Using connections and political influence, he's intervened on behalf. Has managed to convince a general aristocratic Korean to it. There must be something, some misunderstanding. Excellent. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> and now I'm about to infiltrate and then steal. Oh, a lot more awareness. Kind of stings. Okay, we need to think. Now, again, another strange thing with Ophinim is you get your powers to create a theocracy and such way too early. I have no faith, right? I cannot make this anywhere, but look, it's unlocked already at turn 70. It's too, there, should, there should probably be a bit of a rearranging of some of these powers when you get them or what they do, just to give you more things you actually want to use to start with. Um, let's have a quick look at the chat here. You may attack your own faith later, I think, to spread the vampire one with wars while having control of both. Oh, okay. When I play OSF, OSFG, I try to look after my agents. Same. I like it, Andrew. I like to keep them alive. I'm so bad at controlling awareness. Well, look, as you can see, so am I. I focus really hard on one thing and trying to achieve it, and I turn around half the map is covered in wards. Yeah. I, although, listen, a counter to that, Caleb, is to simply ignore um, wards. You know, wards are only useful for shadow. We'll try and use things that don't require as much in the way of, you know, awareness can have less of an impact. Um, madness being the key one, right? If you can get, which is why Malign Catch is so strong, if you can bump Malign Catch in quite a few places, particularly where the Alliance is forming, you can just really lock down some of the, um, the Alliance will potentially tear itself apart anyway. I am a bit concerned about the Alliance mine in this game because awareness is going low. Okay, we'll have a look at you in a sec, but in fact, we'll have a look now. This is kind of my normally, this is how well or badly I'm doing. Look at this. This ain't a good spread by any stretch. It's a lot of awareness and that is kind of nasty. You don't want to see that much. We might have to do some assassinations or other naughtiness, but we'll see. We'll see. I don't think much can be done about awareness yet. You could do dark worship in covens. It is good, yeah, Hello Saucer, so to focus the chosen one to give them busy work. That is an excellent tactic. But it almost, with Ophelim, when you've got one less agent anyway, it's like half of your resource dedicated to that. Although, arguably, it's worth it. If you donate a thousand gold to the Orc Forge, you told them we were here as a visit the Orcs. Curious, Ted Stadia Gaming, and welcome. Thank you for joining. Yeah, I can sacrifice my agent. That's right, villain. <laughs> Let's go, Freffy. We should indeed. Let's go. Apologies. Just checking the chat and welcome. Some point I need the space of a better one. I sometimes just go make a stupid thing so I get a free space. No hard feelings. I'm with you. Listen, I've made a ton of mistakes in my last playthrough. I think I accidentally sacrificed an agent just because, and it was a trickster, Jacob. <laughs> just because I did a bad play effectively so it's easily done super easily done let's get this done quicker you can actually use I think you can use Super Slaver on Lalo oh man I wish I had gold not that we need it actually 
Thanks. Thanks for that. We can influence Vice Circle. Nice. We're right here. Right. So. I don't think we're going to get many wards up here because the awareness is spreading a fairly far away. I think we want Arbomancy, I think. Let's get Arbomancy. Yeah. Let's get that and continue to mess with it as and when we can. And the good thing is, of course, humanity doesn't see that as a bad thing. It might not try and remove it, right? Mediator mandatory. Oh, my word. Right, honestly, these are just going up. They're going loco. I think we can now search by. Can we search by hero that's aware? No. But I can search by mediator. Love this. Oh my, look at what the actual flip. Like, is this just. <laughs> is this just mediators? What? Oops, or mediators or something? What the actual hell is going on here? I need to curb the awareness spread big time. I see an orc with his uh, with a very short life. I would like it if the deep one an orc mechanics uh, do wish future gods focus on them more. Yeah, I agree. I think the orcs and the deep ones could do with a maybe not even a god specific focus, but it would be cool to have a. Um, it would be cool to have a uh, more depth to both of them. If that's a god, great, but it could be anything. Do, 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 do. The Crimson Knight is spreading. I super want this. Can I just look at this a second? Oh, right. Oh my word, I'm all over the shop. Okay, I think it was over here. Because here's what I'm thinking. The Crimson. The Crimson Knight, right. Now we need to overlay that with awareness. Right, remember where the green are. There's definitely some overlap. Right? Now, I don't know if you're aware how the um, vampire tenet works, but you need to kill people. <laughs> and there's no better target to kill <laughs> than aware rulers. Um, we're going to rob the treasury here. I think they've still got a fair bit of gold, I hope. 39? Oh, might as well do sort of thievery. Weak source. And then I'm going to start feeding some uh, heroes weak potions. Nice. Take all that. There goes the world panic. Hold up, wait a second. Wait one damn second here now. The Crimson Knight declares war on the Kingdom of Nagdu. <laughs> Preference danger. What the actual hell is going on? Where are you? And why are you? Ah, uh, I would choose the landed Holy Order that loves war, right? Are you where? Of course you ain't. Because I've got a knife with your name on it when you are. We'll let them battle it out. It won't matter once they're all... The good thing will be there's a lot of death around here, which actually help the vampires. Right, right. Silver linings. <laughs> Begs. <laughs> Let's... Oh, God, I'm tempted to get a... Uh... What's more important? Reduce security. Yeah, probably. More important than a raven. That's so raven. How much gold we got here? Three. No. Oh. Cause you're poor. What? Nobody wants to buy anything. Get gold. Right. Let's bribe the guards and do some infiltrating. What are these? The Warlord is good at influencing orders, but I think that's silly. I don't, not massively uh, keen on that. 
Wild places can be in shadowed. Warlord is pretty great, nothing like that is the next god. A unique agent, what's this? Orc Pope. <laughs> I mean, should it be though? Um, yeah, Dark Worship, it's only holy now. Okay, what's he doing? Of course he's consecrating. 38. 38. I'm not going to attack. I'm really considering it, but I'm not going to. Let's get this city. This city's going up pretty... Half a percent per turn anyway. Do we need it to be? Hmm. I've got a decision to make here. Yeah, let's just do it. We'll infiltrate it and then we'll finish over there, I think. That should take care of itself. Bribing damn guards. Still going to take an absolute eternity. I do like getting might with my old uh, tricky trickster. Oh, and of course, it would be a four. Look at this. It's a four. A four level city, of course. Just to really rub it in there. How long is this going to take her? 25 turns. I so dislike it. Alright, let's get through them. Infiltrate the... Oh, brother guards and infiltrate. I wish he would stop that, that guy, honestly. I might just do Malign Catch, actually, and leave this be. That'll tick up and it'll keep these busy for a long time. Okay, we've got human versus human action. Media and Mandatio Chenyan. Viciously attacks Sister Jia Kunda Huang and humanity turns on itself. And hero battles hero. Sister Jia Kunda Huang. Oh my god, I've got to renounce some of these. My word, it was killed in the conflict. They did this due to the war between the two nations, despite the aversion to harming others. So she's dead. Oh, here we go. And <laughs> May just. <laughs> Maybe we'll be okay, guys. Maybe we're going to survive this. Maybe. <laughs> Who made it? Doombot! Congratulations, thank you. Well, congratulations for joining. Well, no, thank you very much for joining us, Doombot. Lovely to see you. Um, apologies if I've missed anyone. I've been trying to keep up on the, um, on the chat, but I do get pulled away into my own rubbish. So, this is awesome. How long until 22 turns? Because you know what we want, right? We want... How long is it going to be? 15! I really want to start a Vendetta. But without losing, literally sacrificing a, an agent, I've got no way to. Uh, unless we get the event where we can extend it. We'll see. Hopefully we do, because I, I do not want... I 100% want some of that's for me. That'll give us a bit of time to mess with the world. How long have you got? Seven turns, nice. I can't wait this long. This is a horrendous. Sleepless labour, that. All day. The Duchess has died of old age. For some reason, the game blames me. <laughs> and the world panic goes up. <laughs> Sweet Kung Circle. Right. I was going to use power then. We might as well call this, what was it? The Church of the Starry Sky. Might not fit, you know, might not. Oh, it does, it does. Church of the Starry Sky, right? Was that it? Oh, <laughs> pass the popcorn I drew. I'm guessing that's in response to the humans killing each other. <laughs> Danger? Are you planning villainy? Planning on using danger or combat event modifiers for heroes? In what respect? Apologies, villain. I'm probably being stupid, but... Imagine you're speaking to a moron. <laughs> and you won't be far off. So, what do we want? No, we don't want this to take over our own blood. Um, 
religion, right? So we've got to be careful ish here. Let's just do this for now. And I might have this on anti awareness watch. That might be the plan. That might be the plan. Oh, honestly, man. Exorcist, Renihilations. You need to get a grip. You need to have a word with yourself and do something real with your life. Void lice again. Like we ain't seen these. One of them is enough. Um, oh, here we go, look. It's going cray, the awareness. Don't you know who I am? It's a modded one. Just as she is to enter the premises, hosting the social gathering held by the natural philosophers of the city of Nigdu, Jacob Noel is stopped at the gates by the guards. Your agent hands her invitation to the event over the stone guards to examine. They seem to doubt its veracity. I think I've read this one before. There is, of course, something wrong with the forgery. <laughs> These illiterate pie cleaning. I remember this. Simpletons are simply wasting our time in a bid to impress our employees with their seeming diligence on this important night. Oh, one menace for 10 challenge progress. Oh, I'm all over it. Thank you for that, modded events. Can I, can I not, can I like, I think I should and I can. I can and I should, rather. Oh, it's, see, look, this awareness is going bonkers. I don't like it. Duke Quan Jan listens to the news about his child, Jacob Noel. I thought it was a different picture before. Could be wrong. And he weeps. Oh, no. Hold up. He's lost sanity and gained a dislike for his own daughter. Mm. Bet he's got tons of sanity, though, has he? Nine. Enough. Enough. Oh, and here go the wards. Where are they? Oh, my word. Thankfully, they're quite far away. This brother Sidhu Wanapoo's dot. Look at the age. He looks about 12. The hell, man. This poor kid's died of old age. <laughs> they don't last long in these days. What time are we on, by the way? I've got no idea how long I've been going. About an hour and a half. Okay, I need to start wrapping this up because this is going to become a ridiculous epic. What turn are we on? 91. Let's get to 100 real quick. Ish. Wards. Oh, okay. More human on human action. The popcorn's out. Stop them from preaching. That's not a bad idea, actually. Stop them taking over yours. But we want the Crimson Knight to spread, kind of. We also want to influence it one day, but... I have plans. Vis circle. Dismiss. Okay, right. Let's just do... Human plus one. Get the... F honestly. Behave. These humans and their plus ones. Now oh, this looks kind of bad. No snake hole. Oh, what? Right. <laughs> this looks pretty drastic. Yeah, this isn't in a. This is in a bad place. What's the death here? There's no death. Are you kidding me? Hold up. Death. 148. It's all going the catacombs, of course. Right, we absolutely need vampires. The Crimson Knight. Okay. How far away am I like, from actually influencing these at all? Oh, that stinks. It's going to take me literally forever. I might have to start some more active influencing. 30 minutes I don't like either. What we're going to do is we're going to infiltrate this entirely. Hells, yeah, reduce the security. That's what we want. More wards. They're far away. I'll take the wards off in a bit. God, this the guy this guy's just killing. Uh the memory won't fade. 
This guy just loves flipping, killing these holy people. He loves it. And he likes our trickster. Jacob, he likes you. That's good. This like shadow though, that ain't good. What name this dude? Jacob, right, well who wants a name? You can't have one, you've already got him. You've already got one, you're the trickster mate. You can't be everyone. So first one first person to say they want the name is gonna grab it. It's a fairly simple. And then we've got how many turns? Six. Oh my word, I need to hurry up. Do me! Okay, Blangra, you're first. I'll oh, wrist off, I'm sorry. Blangra did get there slightly before you. I'll tell you what, we'll find another one. Blangra. Sorry, wrist off. We'll do another one for you. Blangra, do you want a second name? Blangra the Mangra. No, just me. A combination. Come on, we've got somebody else. Rex can be somebody else. Right, Rex. <laughs> Let's have a look. Who can you be? I'll tell you what, Rex. You can be this lady, I think. Sister loves killing everyone. How's that? Blangra the bold, he is bold, Andrew. Andrea, that's true. No, you're not keen. Wrist off. Slash Rex. <laughs> no, I'm good. Sorry, mate. <laughs> we'll find someone, don't worry. There's plenty of time yet. Literally endless. More wards, where are you at? Okay, this is becoming silly. There's wards and awareness just going. Look at this. As the computer stalls. Nothing on my little island, but that attack really fucked me over. It's going on two turns, nice. <laughs> Would you like to be Narahend Dodakter? Wrist off. Blangrogib, I think he will. Okay, there we are, Rex. Oh, damn. It is... Oh, damn. It's kicking off, Rex. You've got a finger in every goddamn pie, right? Is it just Rex? Have we got anything else? St <laughs> Stabatha. Hula Sorsa. Are we serious? I am tempted. But it's not very Baroness. We need a second name for Stabatha. Nah, villain, I didn't make no mistake, mate. I moved and he just attacked. I think that was some bug. I've heard, I've seen on the Discord there's apparently some bug where agents just start attacking. I've never seen it before now, but I think that was it. I didn't ask him to do that. Rex the Pope. Or Stabatha. You can be Rex the Pope, for God's sake. You can't be Stabatha. Come on now. Rex the Stabatha? No. <laughs> Remember, you're the Pope of the Vampires, right? Just so you're aware. The Vampope. Rex the Vampope, I think, is the one. No, I can't be asked to type it all again. <laughs> Stabatha, <laughs> shank you quick. <laughs> My word. Right, we've got some time before we get a Baroness, as you can see by the like chaotic, the number of just obscene uh, wards everywhere. The hell, brother? We'll come back to you, Supercan, don't you worry. Oh, is this another landed? It is. Damn, damn, damn. Okay. Okay, okay. Diddly -diddly -diddly -diddly. Law. Because the next challenge she's about to do is a law one. And then we're going to have to probably lay low again. Which kind of stinks. Ten turns, I can deal with it. I can halve it though.
Oh, okay, this is a new one. Snowstorm again, I'm sure this is familiar. The wind howls and chills to the bone as the very environment turns against the supplicant who has found himself caught in a snowstorm. The storm brings with it a bitter cold, one much too fearsome for most mortals to endure unless they cower under their cloaks or indoors. But the servants of elder beings might be able to call upon their patron's power to endure what others cannot. I think I've just spent my last power yet. Oh, come on. Oh, uh, I can risk it for the biscuit. Oh, thank God for that. Some can manage to cover themselves, avoid the worst of the howling winds, buffeted them with vicious cold, take some damage on a few occasions, the lack of visibility caused them to stumble into a crevice that would have otherwise been avoided, or finding no shelter for the worst of cold sets in, but it could have been worse. Your agent loses two health. Cool, 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 cool. Go away, go away. Oh my word, honestly, is this... It's here, it's okay. The pure flame, as ours. That's open him's reconciliation. Oh, look at this. I've got no power to play with. <laughs> Blangro is taking the time to visit my Shan Shan. <laughs> Puyang in the name of reconciliation. He seeks an end to the conflict between them. Humanity has enough enemies without turning on itself. It is, he argues, in both their best interests to discuss the matters of civilized folk and come to an agreement which serves their common causes. Their words could be twisted if I had power. Well, I ain't. 75% they both gain a liking. That's gonna stink. Yes! The negotiations fall through raised voices of veiled threats indicate the two are now close to healing the conflict between them. Blangra, I knew you wouldn't let us down. You've been a GM. Blangra. Blangra doesn't make peace. Blangra makes war. <laughs> what turn? 101. I've got to stop, guys. What time is this? Quarter to, quarter to 10. My wife is going to kick my butt for uh, playing so late, so I ought to give it a rest. But um, war's established. Well, there's a surprise. Isn't this the war? Oh, God. Get out of here. She's the one who's going to become a vampire queen. Don't you worry. This game is going to become chaos, I think. I'm going to stop the, the stream, by the way, guys. But this, I think it's going to be really crazy because I think what's going to happen is this. Um, <laughs> we're going we're gonna, to... Well, if we get this vampire faith going, right, we're going to have to do a bit of a killing spree because vampires can only be made from corpses, right? So you have to end up killing a few things. And there is not much better to kill than a werefolk. Um, so I think we're going to go on a bit of a, like a mad, 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 mad killing spree with uh, old Jacob here. Um, we'll see. There's certainly going to be some, uh, some of the, uh, what are they called? What the hell are these called now? Um, acolytes are definitely going to be killed, but especially if they're aware. They have to be. They need to become vampires, right? And only dead can become vampires. But anyway... Thank you ever so much for watching, everybody. Um, I'll see. I don't think this is going to work, but I'll try and get my camera back on just for the end. Nah, it's dead. It's brown bread. Anyway, hopefully next time it'll decide to work. Thank you for watching, ladies and gents. As always, it's been a pleasure. Uh, it's been lovely to do this, actually, to interact with you all. Um, I think I'm going to do the next plays like this, to be honest, of this of this. Uh, I've opened him uh, probably every Thursday maybe I'll throw in three Saturdays if I get chance um, obviously just keep an eye on the on the uh, channel to see what the crack is um, but thank you everybody for joining me it's very very much appreciated and rip camera indeed Caleb thank you Aaron <laughs> uh, not as good as your streams but you know oh, it's okay um, good thank you I'm glad you're looking forward to the rest of it Caleb um, thank you everybody for joining us I'm, honestly I really really do appreciate it thank you for becoming a member um, I've got to check who that was uh, I've never had a member before this is all very new to me peeps and if you're thinking about making money on YouTube <laughs> unless you're very big <laughs> forget it right because you don't make no money on the YouTube so I'm afraid uh, certainly not when you're as big as me anyway Thank you, Felden, for becoming a member. And Aaron, thank you very much for the tip. I'll be sure to send it back to you at some point, no doubt. <laughs> uh, but yes, thank you ever so much for watching, guys. 
I think the next one will be on Thursday or Saturday. Keep an eye out for that. And uh, I will see you, as always, on the next uh, on the next game. Right, let's see if I can do this. How much you want to bet I'll bottle this? Right, we're ready. Are you ready for this? Let's see if it works. <laughs>